What's up, everybody? This is Gobag Big Brigade Brigade. I can't even speak. I haven't even had a drink. I know. Fuck it. Hey, okay. I'm gonna go away. God, have you? Yeah. Oh, you always do. Right. I don't. So I can't. Well, that's a good fight. Yeah. <laughs> All right, ready? Three, two, one. What's up, everybody? Baddest dudes here, baby. We're doing a special new style of videos. We are gonna be drinking Fridays, beers, blitz, Battlestar Collect. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so we're doing something fun, new, uh, basic and simple. I like to drink. Rooks likes to drink. Why not buy beers that we've never had before? And you guys get to see our experiences. We'll talk a little bit about the beer, and then we'll tell you what we rate it out of five. Sounds good. Sounds good. All right, so today we have a, let's see, dun, 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 stone beer. Ba -da 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 it is a stout, a Woot stout. It is a stout pecan uh, that has wheat and rye. One quarter aged in bourbon beer. And if you actually look, there's like a little superhero dude like right here, you know what I'm saying? Uh, he's right here and this guy's fighting this orangutan dude. So the thing looks pretty cool. I don't know. I went with it. Why not? Rooks didn't even know about it until today that I got something. So costs a little bit more price here, but it better be good. So... The smell smells like heaven. That fucking smells good. That smell, when Rooks is excited, well, you, can, as, you can as, smell the bourbon. Not as good as Sackbrook. And but. you guys, when you see this stuff, you can see like it's thick. It's a little thicker. It's dark. So we'll see how the taste is. Cheers, my friend. Sure. Cheers, YouTube world. That's interesting. You can taste the rye immediately. Yeah. That's the only drawback. It's it's weird. I wonder if the pecan, that's what's coming out with it. Maybe the pecan and, and a rye, it's it's a weird like taste in your mouth it, immediately. It afterwards you taste the bourbon. You do taste the bourbon, you feel it going down like right here, so it's almost like you're drinking straight up bourbon. But you get like a hint of Man. I don't know. No, it's definitely pecan. It's pecan with rye right on your nose. And it's kind of like, it's got like a thick, so when you first like get the initial sip, it's got like a little thick um, feel to it. Yeah. And then also it gets bubbly and burns down the throat. Yeah, definitely. So I guess if you're a big fan of bourbon, or you like the burn, it's not a bad beer. No. It's not as hyped up as the dude said, but it's not bad. Maybe a third sip's key. Let's try it again. Uh, everyone's apparently hitting me up right now on Facebook. Nah, that's text messages. I'm popular. You guys didn't know that? Go oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's very bubbly, too. Do you, do you get the yes. bubbles? So... This would be good for something like um, barbecue. Barbecue. Barbecue and Thanksgiving. I yeah. can see a Thanksgiving dinner. So now a turkey? Yeah, so a nice turkey warm lane. meal. And it's it, this is meant for a warm meal. Yeah. Not lunch. Not breakfast. Mm -hmm. Dinner and I'm burping it up already. How's the burp taste? It tastes not bad. I'm apparently I'm buzzing. Everyone's texting me right now. It's about the Cubs. We we did not do well today. Oh god. Okay. Yeah, uh, that's not surprising. We need to reamp our team. But we're not talking about the Cubs. We're talking about a nice, smooth stout that has a nice burn. It's so the initial taste is weird. I don't care for the initial taste as much. No. But I like the aftertaste and I like the burp. I burped a couple times already, so the burp feels nice. I actually kind of like that aftertaste. It's just not like the blueberry. Uh, oh gosh, we had a blueberry sacrifice. We'll talk about that another time. When we do, we're, we'll do a sacrifice because we're hyping this place up, so we'll have to do a small little video there. But here, out of five, what would you rate it? I'd say like a three and a half. Three and a half? I'd say three seven five. Three seven five. Maybe after a full one, I might change my mind. But I'm. I don't like the initial taste. The aftertaste, I don't mind, but it's too bubbly. I just don't like the... I feel the foam right here. Yeah. It's, it's thick, but it's not thick enough. Yeah. So, they could have done better. A little disappointed. But I'm not upset I got it. No. Definitely not. So, on that note, ladies and gentlemen, we cheers to you. And we'll see you next Friday.